Following yesterday's birthday pattern we also have two birthday girls and two birthday boys today the age difference is quite large because the oldest of them was born in 1931 and the youngest in 1988. In addition the older one performed at the first Eurovision in 1956 and the youngest performed now in 2017. That is quite interesting the other two have both set a mark on the song contest, one got second place and the other was the first to get zero points at Eurovision. The birthday people are Freddie Quinn, John Tejan, Ani Lorak and Alma Freddie Quinn, 86 Freddie performed for Germany at the first Eurovision ever in 1956, that year was the only year when countries performed two songs each. The song is catchy rock and roll song and is called So Jet Das Jeetnacht. It is about this guy being disappointed that his girl chooses all the others but not him. And for the results, we can only say that he did not win because the points were never made public. The song sound familiar and feels like I have heard it covered in other language. But I'm sure I have never heard it in Japanese. Have you John Tejan, 68 Well somebody needs to be the first one Unfortunately for John his entry Mill at her mill in 1972 was the first song to get zero points with the current voting system. Despite that rest of Europe did not fall for the song and became a big hit in his home country Norway. However John Tejan Eurovision story is much longer than just this song, he represented Norway two more times as well as entering Norwegian national selections the Melodi Grad pre-14 times his next song at Eurovision is called A G which he sang in a duet with Anita Skorgen in 1982. Anita and John were married at that time. They ended in 12th place out of 18. The third performance, in Germany 1984, was the charm that is his best results at Eurovision. His song which he wrote with Anita is called, Do Remy and ended in 9th place out of 18. Ani Lorak, 39 Ani first attempted to enter Eurovision in 2005, but ended in 2nd place in the national selection. But she came so close to winning that year, that the Ukrainian television, NTU, chose Lorak to perform at Eurovision 2008. She sang five songs, and out of those Shady Lady won, after advancing from the second semi-final, the Ukrainian entry received 230 points, thus getting second place. Sparky dress and catchy tune made its impression on Eurovision Alma, 29 the youngest of the September 27th Eurovision birthday people is Alma. Alma represented France this year with the song Requiem. The song is mostly in French, but has a little of English to the chorus. Alma's charm and her sweet voice did good, and ended up in 12th place at the final. Here is a short interview we Eskstra took with her at the London Eurovision party. We at Eskstra would like to thank all four of them for their tribute to Eurovision. And of course wish them wonderful birthday Icelandic Eurovision fan.